welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back. Well, today I wanted to bring my Syngonium collection, you guys, because um, I'm finna get ready to put them outside on the patio. I told you once before that I really damaged my Syngoniums when I sprayed them with neem oil. And I wanted to show them to you because I'm really finna cut all my damaged leaves off. I, I just cannot stand to look at the damaged leaves on plants. So I want to show them to you. And then um, I'm going to cut the damaged leaves off. I'm going to put what's left on them. I'm going to put them on this trellis. I got these from Amazon, but I'm going to put them on the trellis and then I'm going to put them outside and see how they do. Now, y'all not going to believe this. It had been feeling like spring for the longest. Then Monday, it was 28 degrees that morning. The high was 40. That was Monday. Today is Thursday. You guys, it's 86 degrees outside. 86 degrees drastic jump but monday was the first day of spring and i guess what uh people call that easter snap i guess it is passed now hopefully so i am going to sit my syngonians outside now the low is supposed to be like 62 or so so you know tonight and for the rest of the week and so on so hopefully spring has really sprung this time and it's going to stay so I want to show you my plants that had the most damage. And uh, this one right here, y'all can see, look at that. It, it, I hate, oh, I hate so much. I sprayed that neem oil on these plants, but um, yeah. But it's still giving me some new growth. Y'all can see right here. I still got some new growth coming in right there. And then another one. Uh, Y'all can't see that right there. So I'm going to cut these damaged leaves off, put it up on a trellis. That's what I'm going to do with that one. And here's my other one. Now, none of these um, Syngoniums I bought for. This was a cutting from somebody, but it has grown tremendously. And it was doing well until I sprayed that neem oil on it. And this was another cutting um, that was doing well. And this thing broke off right here. This is another cutting that was doing well. But, and I, I've already peeled a lot of, you know, cut a lot of leaves off of this one. And I just hate uh, that it's not doing good. But... We're gonna see about how it does, y'all, when I put them back outside. And I'll give y'all an update on that. And this one, my Syngonia Maria. Oh, look at that, y'all. I mean, just terrible. Look at all the damage up in there. I tell you, I am determined to be successful with these Syngonians. I really am. Um, I didn't I didn't buy any of them already big, but I was liking, you know, they was putting out new leaves. I like them see I like to see them grow. Um but I tell you. But this one right here, this is my Syngonium bronze now. I did not put any neem oil on this one, so that's why it's still looking so good. I did not uh, damage the leaves on this one with any neem oil. I bought this one after I sprayed the neem oil on the plant. So this one still looks good and healthy, and I'm happy about that. So I'm sure she's going to thrive really good when I put her outside. And this one, I didn't spray her leaves with the neem oil, and I don't not necessarily know why, but... Um, I did spray around the bottom of it, but she don't look so bad either. She just got one damaged leaf on here. You can see that right there. So she's still looking good. And uh, so I'm hoping she thrives when I 
put her outside. But yeah, this is really my worst looking one. <laughs> Look at that, y'all. My worst looking one. But I'm going to cut all these leaves off. And uh, I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, I'm back. I cut all my damaged leaves off. And so now I'm going to show them to you when I cut my damaged leaves off. Um, so this is my Syngonium Maria. I know she looks really... Look at her. She looks so naked. But hopefully the next time I show her to you, she has she's going to really been filled out. And uh, so we'll see. So I cut all my damaged leaves off of her. And here's my other one. Look at her. They look so puny. But she does have new leaf coming in. So I cut all my damage off of her. And I cut my damage off of her, except I didn't cut this one off. Uh, I left it. I left that one, but um, so we'll see if I end up having to cut it off. But anyway, I put her on the trellis, and um, we're going to see what she does. Now, I went to the nursery. <laughs> like I said, all these plants, I have never bought a full, just luscious Syngonium before I always buy them small and or it's, I had uh, cuttings for you guys. I went to the nursery and I just could not pass her up. So let me show it to you. <laughs> Look at her. Isn't she beautiful? Absolutely. Just beautiful. I am determined to have these Syngonians do good and live in my care. Um, so now I have six Syngonians and hopefully these will get lush and big like this one. Look at that. Just beautiful y'all. <laughs> I'm so happy. Wow. I mean, she is just full. Look at those leaves. I just love the shape of these leaves. They so pretty. And almost like it's two different kinds up in here. So you see the difference in those leaves? This kind and then this kind. So I'm not sure. It may be two different kinds. And then look at this one. That one right there. I couldn't pass it up, y'all. I just could not pass her up. She was $24.99. Uh, but she's gorgeous. So I'm going to hang her outside. And we're going to see how they do. Once again, this is the one that I put on the trellis, cut all my damage off. And I know she's looking a little skimpy, but. And this one, look at her. Mm -mm -mm. We're going to work on it though. We're going to give them some good care and hopefully they're going to bounce back. And look at this one. So. We're going to see what, what they do, you guys. And I will bring come back and give you an update on these. So we'll see. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for tuning in. I really, really, really appreciate it. And see you next time. Bye.